Hey guys, welcome back to the Maybelline channel. My name is Lily Chi and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to achieve this makeup look which is perfect for prom. So, first step already was just to start with clean hands, a clean face. I've already prepped my skin and I'm also just going to tie my hair back. Okay, there we go. So, I am going to start with the Instant Age Rewind Perfector 4-in-1. This has been one of my favorite products recently. <laughs> I'm obsessed with this whipped matte texture. It acts as a BB cream, primer, concealer, um, and mattifying powder all in one. And yeah, it just goes onto my face super smooth. I like to use my hands to apply it and then... I will use a brush to sort of blend it out. I'm gonna add a little more. Um, I'm actually using the shade number two in light medium. Um, yeah, look at that. It just goes on so easy. I have been really into mattifying makeup looks. I'm just gonna take this brush that I have and even it out a little bit and there we go I feel like it really evens out my skin tone and my complexion and it's my perfect base next I'm gonna go in with the fit me concealer um, and this one's in the shade fair I like to do a little bit of a lighter shade so it really brightens my under eyes and I just take it and do this. Do -do. Um, so I actually had a really weird prom experience because my school didn't have a prom because my junior year was COVID which was 2020. So there was no prom and then the next year 2021 my senior year I also didn't have a prom but I ended up getting invited to this a boys school prom in New York. So yeah, I'm just gonna take this beauty sponge and blend this out. Um, I love how brightening this is and it also just blends very easily. So I went to this all boys school prom and I actually, like a lot of my friends were there from the city, which was really funny that I were, wasn't expecting to see there. And it was so much fun, but it was kind of weird. It was almost like a blind date because my friend had invited me. She was like, oh, like this is your date. I met up with him like one time before going. Um, so it was literally like almost <laughs> like doing a blind date. But we ended up actually having a really good time and we did a lot of dancing. And it was kind of funny to be at a different school's prom because it was like we saw all these like baby pictures of the kids and stuff and I didn't really know a lot of people so I kind of felt like <laughs> I felt, felt like an imposter. Next I'm using one of my favorite blushes which is the Cheek Heat and it's like a gel cream blush. So if you have seen me do my makeup before or heard me talk about makeup you will know that I love cream blushes. This is actually like one of my favorites and I'm just using a darker shade to get, put it on my face like this and blend it out. And I'm gonna take a little more and you can actually, like what I like to do with this product, you can put a little bit here and then take your favorite blush brush and Kind of, yeah, that, see that looks so pretty. Oh, love that. Yeah, I love natural glam makeup looks. For the prom that I went to, I just had a black dress. It was very like elegant and simple. So my makeup was also just pretty simple. And yeah, that looks awesome. Next, I'm going to be using the City Bronzer. I'm not really <laughs> getting into these kinds of products recently, especially with summer. Oh my god, I love that. Like, look. Looks a little crazy right now, but I'm gonna blend it out. But I love, like, look how it, like, snatches my face back. Oh, it looks so good. And I just put some on 
the on my like forehead to get that like sun-kissed look love that oh yeah I love it it like snatches your face back so well I love this product I think that this powder gives like a really soft natural contour look and it really like sculpts your face so nice oh my god like look I'm obsessed so yeah I'm just gonna put some kind of like on my jaw and I heard it's really good to blend this sort of upwards but yeah look at my face I feel like it's a little more sculpted so for eyes I'm going to be using the nudes of New York palette which I love I am honestly not the best <laughs> with eyeshadow I don't really always know what I'm doing I feel like when it comes to it but I love this palette because I feel like it's so universally flattering and there's also just so many nice easy shades to use like if you're a somewhat beginner <laughs> like me um, I'm gonna take the shade Solid. I like to use my finger to apply to create like a buildable sort of texture when I'm doing it so yeah I'm just gonna use Solus um, and put that here and I love adding just like a natural eyeshadow shade to sort of open up my eye and give it a lifted effect. So yeah, I'm just going to do that. And then I'm going to add a little bit of Dreamer on, the shade Dreamer on. And I'm going to put that in the crease of my eye because I want like a little bit of sparkle. Just like that. See, I love that. It like, it's very subtle. You can't really tell, but I like how much it kind of brightens your eye. And put a little bit here. Okay, now for me, my signature look involves a cat eye. I'm obsessed with eyeliner and I love this for a prom look. For honestly any look, like <laughs> if you've seen my videos, you know I love eyeliner. I love this Maybelline Tattoo Studio Smoky one because it is very precise and I also like how it's kind of gel and that for me is very easy to paint on um, an eyeliner. So yeah, look, I love I love the sparkle like in my in my crease that I have going on right now. So yeah, I, what I do is I start from here, like that, and then it looks kind of messy, but we're going to fix that, and then I almost do it like connect the dots, so I'm going to go here, and there we go, that's it, and then, yeah, you just like, fill in any parts that you missed. I love that. I feel like it really elevates the look and also helps to kind of snatch back your face. And one thing that I like to do with this liner is I'm going to put a little bit in the corner of my eye like this. And then I take this part, like the opposite end of the brush, and I go like this and drag it out oh my god yes look at that and it gives it like it kind of like softens it a little bit and brings it under my eye which i feel like makes your eye pop even more so i'm just gonna replicate this on my other eye as well i do love like kind of like a sharp eye look i also like um i also like it when it looks a little bit more dragged out and sort of softened okay Next step will be to use mascara. I like this mascara is just kind of iconic. I feel like everyone <laughs> has this in their beauty bags, the Lash Sensational Sky High Mascara. This will be the first coat. Oh my gosh, this mascara is so good. It's so buildable. Look at the difference. I mean, 
come on. Add, I keep adding coats and I love this because it doesn't clump your lashes. Like look, you can like still see all my individual lashes and it gives it that very like spidery look. Going on this side. And oh my god, look, like, ah! I'm actually obsessed with this look. I feel like it's very, like, glamorous. Like, I feel like this is perfect for prom. Um, because also, like, I feel like your dress is, like, a statement. You know what I mean? So, for me, I've, even for red carpets and stuff, I've never done anything super crazy. I always just really like to keep, like, a natural, like, simple, like, but beautiful glam. So, it doesn't really, like, take away from the outfit. I'm just gonna add... Some mascara to lower eyelashes. Obsessed. Now I'm going to use the Master Chrome. Oh, like, look at that. I'm going to use the Master Chrome highlighter, and I love it because I feel like this look kind of ended up being really soft and almost a little peachy. So, yeah, highlight is a super important part of this process. I'm just gonna take like an angled brush and sweep that onto my um, cheekbone area like this. Oh my god, I love it. And I like to kind of brush it all the way up. Look at that glow, yes. Also, I feel like prom is, I mean, it's, prom is always obviously in the later months. So when you're getting those like sunlight pictures <laughs> before you go, like in the afternoon, slay. Um, okay, and then I also lo obviously love to do a little bit of nose highlight. So I just go on the tip of my nose like so. So pretty. And then I'm also going to do my Cupid's bow, which is this area above my lips. Obsessed. So because the makeup is kind of simple, I want to do a bolder lip and I'm going to use the Superstay Matte Ink. Guys, these literally smell so good too. Like I can't. <laughs> it just smells so good. Okay, so my lips are moisturized. I'm gonna go in and apply this. Mmm. Love. And the texture is so nice. Like, it's so, like, creamy and soft, and it's not sticky. Oh my gosh, I love. And in person, it's almost more of, like, a plummy, like, purple color. Slay. Okay. Oh my god, okay, I love this lip, like, it's beautiful, and now I'm going to use this, now I'm going to use this gloss in this color number 5 petal, um, and it has hyaluronic acid, which if you know, you know, it really plumps your lips, so I'm just going to put it over top of the matte lip for, because this will be long lasting, and I just want to add like a little bit of a shine, a shimmer. Uh, oh my god, I love that. I love how it doesn't take off like the color um, of the matte lip. Oh my god, this also just smells so good too. Uh, it just kind of adds to it. Slay. Okay, then finally for some final touches, I used a lot of... I feel like I actually used a good mixture of like cream and matte makeup, but I'm just gonna add some of this uh, Fit Me blush on top of what I already did, um, just to kind of bring the whole look together. This one is in the shade Pink Rose. On set when I was little, they would always be like, smile so we can get the apples of your cheeks because I when I would put on my <laughs> blush as a kid like I just kind of like put it all over but you want to get the apples of your cheeks 
Oh my gosh. Love. Um, I'm also going to use some of the Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder. Just to, yeah, also sort of like pull the whole look together. It's also just going to help like brighten up the under eyes. Yes. I feel like I achieved the look that I was kind of going for. I love how natural it is and my, I'm obsessed with like the eye, how it's kind of bold but subtle and I have like the little shine in the corner. The face looks snatched. I love these lips. I feel like they look very kissable, which is perfectly appropriate for prom. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe down below to the Maybelline channel and let me know in the comments what your favorite part of this video was or what Maybelline products you loved the most, which ones you want to try. And yeah, bye guys.